wagons as an unloaded mass of 1,500 kg. One of the wagon carries a load uh, of m kg and the other is unloaded. The wagons are moving towards each other. So whenever you have a question like this, please um, sketch, draw a free body diagram or sketch it roughly so that you can imagine. Okay, and drawing really helps. You know, I always tell this. So I'm going to draw this. So <clears throat> that's m kg load. And it's moving towards each other. Okay, the wagon are moving towards each other at the same rate, each at the speed of two uh, meter per second. Okay, so both are moving at two meter per second. Okay, before collision. And the weight itself is 1500 kg, the weight of the wagon itself. Okay. So two cajun, two wagons as an unloaded mass of 1,500, one wagon carries a load of m kg. So I'll make the one uh, at A, okay, and then at B. Okay, the one at A is m kg, and then uh, the other one is unloaded, so it's just empty. The wagons are moving towards each other at the speed of 2 meter per second. When they collide, immediately after the collision, the loaded wagon is at rest. Okay, and then the speed of the unloaded wagon is 3 meter per second. Okay, so after collision, so I'm going to draw another one. <coughs> okay, so the loaded wagon, okay, immediately after the collision, the loaded wagon is at rest. Okay, mkg is at rest, so v equals 2 zero meter per second okay and then the uh, unloaded wagon is traveling at three meter per second okay so this is traveling at three meter per second okay so okay now Let's do this. So 1500 kg multiplied by 2 meter per second plus, okay, that's towards the left, so it should be negative 2 meter per second multiplied by 1500. Okay, so total momentum before the collision is equal to the total momentum after the collision. Okay, so this one equal to ah, okay, forgot to do this. So M plus, yeah, okay, now oh, that's correct. Okay, so M plus, and then this is equal to um, so. It's moving the loaded wagon is at rest so V equals to 0 so 0 multiplied by M plus 1500 doesn't matter it's okay, still going to give us 0 and multiply by negative 3 remember it's minus so negative 3 meter per second multiplied by 1500 okay multiply by 1500 okay so if I do this so I will get 2m plus 3000 minus minus 2 times by 1500 which is another 3000 and this is equal to 0 times by whatever it's just 0 minus 3 times by 1500 which is negative 4500 so these two gets cancelled so what's left here is 2m equals to negative 4500 okay and m equals to negative 4500 divided by 2 and if you look at it negative is just the direction okay so since we are looking at mass so you you can discard the negative so your answer is 2250 kg